Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I will start my very short remarks with congratulations to all of you on the occasion of the International Day of Democracy. And our conference, which was quite interesting and successful during the last two days, was organized in order to end it now, during the Day of Democracy. And this is not just coincident, it was planned event because the issues and topics we addressed during the conference are about the democracy and are about the ways and tools how to spread it around the world. Therefore, I want to congratulate to everybody who present here in this room, representatives of more than 30 countries, and I want to congratulate this event to my fellow Georgians, and I want to address them in Georgian, of course. Gilotsaut, Kalvatonebo, Dabatonebo, Demokrati Isayat Shoris Odres, Esar Izaliam Nishnolovan Idre, Nishnolovan Imitats, Rom Dres, Sakartoloshim, Opebian, Demokrati Is, Liderebi, Otsda Azemeti, Kwernidan, Chuan Konda Zalian, Armatebuli Konferencia, Sakanodobolo Proces Is, Riaoba Standakav Shirebit, Ta Chuan Is, Tumrebi, Chuan Tan Ertat, Zeimo Ben Amdres. Ats Kualazem Nishnolovania, Chuan Gadao Tsukritel, Trevan Del Dre, Gwezeima, Aram Kholod Konferenci Is, Monatsi Leb Tan Ertat, Aramed Pirwelikshi, Sakartuelos, Oelaze, Nishnelovan, Simdidres Tanerta, Chuans Ahagaz Lev Tanerta, Ahagaz Levirom Levitz Armod Genes, Hodas Founuest Tetevs, Tat Chuan Guinda, Drevandeli Saramo, Matanga Watarot, Tamata Seknebat, Hoguenevitz Ashuleba, Tauyanti Mosas Rebevi Mogwaxenan. I want to underline that today we are celebrating this day together with the main resource of this country, the youth. The people who represent more than 10 different universities of Georgia, they are trying to become professionals in different fields, but they are committed Democrats, and that's why they are invited here. And they will have opportunity to share their views later on. We are celebrating this event in this beautiful building, which is quite historic for Georgia, because during 19th century, the representative of Russian Empire, Empire was uh, sitting here and ruling from here all South Caucasus, which was then part of the whole Russia. But the building is historic not only because of that, but because of something else. Because when the Russian Empire was broken, this was the place when Georgia announced its independence in 1921. Unfortunately, that independence started only for three years, and Russians came back again with their Red Army and occupied Georgia. But there is even more history in this building, because in those days, two other countries declared their independence from Russian Empire. It was our neighbors from Armenia and from Azerbaijan. So this building was carrying these very important messages. And then that was the time when first Democratic Republic of Georgia was born. Therefore, this is the right place to celebrate Day of democracy around the world. And I wish you all to see the day during our lifetime when we will celebrate not the International Day of Democracy, but the Day of International Democracy. I wish this to everybody. Thank you. Honorable Speaker, thank you very much. Honorable Speaker, good evening, and all, and all the guests. I am so honored to be standing here and talking in front of youthful faces, the future of our world, those that hold and are the custodians of the democratic processes of the world. Thank you very much for being a part of us today. I think, Speaker, it was very considerate of you to choose this day as the closing day and inviting the people that are the custodians of democracy in our world and who are the custodians of the future of our great-grandchildren, of our great-great-grandchildren, but also those that will hold our histories dear to their hearts and have them spoken about in our quest to entrench democracy. With very little words, I would like to say welcome to everybody this, uh, this evening and thank you very much for having invited me over. Thank you.